And now, The View from Washington, an explanation of U.S. policy. In an address to the nation after Iran launched dozens of missiles at bases in Iraq that house U.S. troops, President Donald Trump expressed resolve to protect American lives, while at the same time offering Iran the opportunity for future cooperation and diplomatic engagement. Iran launched the attacks days after the United States killed IRGC Quds Force Commander Qasem Soleimani, a terrorist responsible for the maiming and murder of thousands of U.S. troops. Soleimani also was the architect of the recent attacks on U.S. personnel in Iraq that badly wounded four service members and killed an American contractor and was planning new attacks. Soleimani's hands were drenched in both American and Iranian blood. He should have been terminated long ago. By removing Soleimani, we have sent a powerful message to terrorists. If you value your own life, you will not threaten the lives of our people. President Trump announced that the United States will immediately impose new economic sanctions on the Iranian regime in response to Iran's aggressive behavior, but he made no mention of further U.S. military action. American strength, both military and economic, is the best deterrent. The United States is ready to embrace peace with all who seek it. Finally, the president addressed the people and leaders of Iran. We want you, he said, to have a future and a great future, one that you deserve, one of prosperity at home and harmony with the nations of the world. That was The View from Washington, an explanation of U.S. policy.